Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. Today, I've got another episode of What's Poppin'. <clears throat> and I sent away for this from a um, place called, I believe it was uh, Galactic Snacks. And this one apparently is ultra rare. Uh, I don't know um, when it was out, and I think it's just kind of weird. Uh, I was only able to get it in the zero sugar. This is by Mountain Dew, and it's called Mountain Dew zero sugar blue okay and notice this is going to be the new design for the can it's spelled out mountain dew and they've gone back to the uh the old uh old artwork and you can see all the imports and stuff it's kind of cool it's got like a astronauts and sharks and whatever stuff on the label and it's all in japanese so um yeah Zero K cow. So it is zero sugar. So um, I have no idea what to expect about it. And I'm going to give it a try for you guys out there. I have a frosted glass with some ice. And uh, we're going to get blue. <laughs> Am I blue? I'm telling you, I am blue. All right, here we go. Okay, that is blue. It looks like Windex. It looks like uh, antifreeze or something like that. I think it's going to be blue raspberry, but we'll find out. All right, I'm blood. Settle, yes. Very, very blue and almost electric. So here we go. Mountain Dew blue for you. Strangely reminiscent of the Pepsi Blue. They had that out a couple of years ago. Believe it or not, I have a six-pack I have saved. <laughs> it's probably a couple years old and it's probably gone flat, but I still have it. So if you're a fan of Blue and Blue Raspberry, you'd probably like this. I can kind of taste that zero-sugar aftertaste. It's got that artificial Blue Raspberry flavor. But it's not bad. Tastes a lot like the Pepsi Blue. <laughs> and I don't know if they had sugar-free. I don't think they did. But yeah, I'm tasting the remnants of that uh, zero sugar and real kind of artificial tartness of that blue raspberry. Reminiscent of the one that they had, Frostbite, which is uh, now is going to be discontinued. So pick it up while you can. Um, I don't know. Not real wild about this flavor. Just kind of um, tasting mostly the zero sugar sweetener. Uh, getting a little bit of the blue raspberry vibe, but not a whole lot. So would I get this one again? Probably not, even if it was in full sugar. Uh, a lot of a lot of hassle to get through. I think it was like three ninety nine for this um, can, but it's interesting. I've tried it. Yeah, not my favorite flavor. They've got a lot of other ones. But I'm still still partial to Code Red and the OG, and then the um, Voltage and uh, Baja Blast. Those are kind of my favorites, but this one's okay. Uh, wouldn't go out of my way for it. So for the Mountain Dew Zero Sugar Blue, seven, seven out of 11. It's okay. It's in interesting. It's different. It's unique. It's, it's Mountain Dew and strange flavor. So if you want to be adventurous and you want to track it down, give it a try. Put it over ice. Put it in the refrigerator. Get it nice and cold. See if you like it. So there you go, guys. That's a uh, take on a Mountain Dew flavor. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. 
Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying something new and blue for you that you do so well. Um, be on the lookout for new flavors. And um, yeah, see what I can find. So until next time, guys, I'll talk to you later. Cheers, everybody.